Hi all, I wanted to talk with you about what to do if you if we have a panic attack, panic attack, whether it's me, you or anybody else. The best thing to do is is to talk talk with someone about it, someone that you trust, because I just found out today, just after I done the first video part, well when I did the video when I did when I did the video about. How to avoid how to avoid a panic attack? I recently did. I just 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 now just realized just just found out that it that a panic attack is also to do with mental illness. Don't be scared. Don't be scared of that word mental illness. If you if you if you're terrified of the fact of being mentally ill, you know just use it use it as a use it as a strength to to help out to help others don't don't be don't beat yourself up if you think you might be might have mental illness if you've got more than just a panic attack if you've got other symptoms as well don't panic talk talk to someone that you, talk to someone that you trust because if you if you talk to talk to just a random person or someone a random friend a friend that you, that, that 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 is always not serious about things you, you know that doesn't take the mickey about what you, whatever you say to them. So if if someone takes if 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 you talk if you talk to a friend that takes the mickey out of what you say to them, of what of what of what you say to them, uh, then obviously they're not to be trusted. But just do it. Take, but just share it with someone that you trust, and also tell your tell tell your local GP. Or if you're very very young. If you're very very young, tell your parents. If you haven't got no parents, then tell someone you trust. Overall, just tell somebody that you trust that you have that you have panic attacks, especially when you have more than one. But even if you got, even if you just got one, doesn't matter how long it is the panic attack. Just tell somebody that you trust, please, for your own sake. Not for my sake. Not for me to get to get many views. Or to get likes or dislikes or comments, just for your own benefit. I'm only doing it. I'm only doing this video for purely for your own benefit. So I hope this helps you guys and gals. So before I go, I just wanted to say a quick prayer. So Heavenly Father, thank you for your grace and mercy that you put upon us from past, present, and future. Help us, oh God, to help us to understand panic attacks, and to help us to seek the right, seek the right, right advice for people that are suffering with panic attacks, however many times it is, and how, and for however, for however, however long, Father, pray not to fall upon that situation, oh God, that you're able to strengthen us, oh God, as we as we go through this problem of panic attacks and situations, help we help that we're able to help us to be brave in in in. In finding the right advice and seeking the right right friend or family member, or anyone or the, or the right person, help us to seek, help us to find the right confidence to seek the right to seek the right person to ask, and to have the confidence to ask that person for help and advice, Father. Help them to find the, the, the person that they trust, or even even if it's just someone that you meet across. Even if it's just someone, even if it's just someone that you don't see that, often, even if it's someone that we, somebody that we don't see that often, Father, I pray that they're able to gain, they're able to gain the gain of the courage to be able to find, to be able to, so gain the courage to be able to find the right words to say to, to, to say that they need help, oh God. I pray grace and mercy will be upon that, it will be upon that, Father. I plead the blood of Jesus Christ in situation. Rain on him, fall upon us, I pray these things all in Jesus' name. We pray, Amen. God bless you guys, gals. Bye for now. Peace be with you.